When is the only time you won't be thinking about having a good time on the limo bus? It's when you're busting to go to the toilet. So the limo bus didn't have a toilet, so Damien gave us a call and said, hey, can you put a toilet in my bus? I said, yeah, sure. Can't be that hard. Okay, I'll just show you inside the, uh, the limo bus to show you where we're hoping to put the toilet and the little basin. Okay, so it's up here, there's a little cupboard here, party bus. Awesome. So there's a little cupboard in here. Okay, it's just uh, used to store stuff. So got hopefully got to put the toilet over there somewhere and then the basin just uh, on the side of the door here. And then um, that should all, all work out pretty well. And then underneath, I'll show you that. Around the side of the bus here, there's a an actual cupboard or like a storage container under here. It's meant to have gas struts, but that's where we're going to put the tanks, hopefully. So hopefully we'll fit it all in there. So anyway, we've just got to play it by ear and see how it goes. But I'll ew, stay tuned. Exciting stuff. Limo bus. Okay, so we are totally sorted. Um, it's nice from the owner. Gives us a bit of a hand. I've taught him how to thread seal and stuff like that. So he's done a lot of the stuff that uh, when I was busy figuring out the uh, hard things. So I'll show you how it's all turned out. So now before, it was just a cupboard that he had at the front of his bus, right? So that's where the cupboard, cupboard was. Okay, you can see that. I'll just give you a quick run down. Okay, so just spin you around. So that was the cupboard there that um, they used to store mops in and stuff. So great, great spot. So now you open it up. Um, we put new lino down on the floor there. So cut all that to suit. So you're yeah, really happy with how it worked out. Put this little base in it as well. And I don't know if you can see underneath, we made up this special uh, bracket for it. So it's just the silicon's just drying. So that holds it there nicely. And uh, so yeah, the tap should should all start to work and so they'll wash their hands and stuff. And this is a little uh, Thetford toilet. Um, now it's got a, a button down here that you push with your foot. So when you when you do your business, just push it off and it flushes it down and off it goes down to the tank. So um, yeah, really good. So if you're busting, you can just party on now. Um, still plenty of room. Back in the white and stuff. So I'll show you um, also outside where it all, all the poo and all the stuff goes as well. Kids love having it at, at the house here. So this is the uh, the cupboard I was talking about where we put the tank. Okay. So here's the uh, the, the toilet line. So it goes straight down in, into the tank here. So we have to install this as an access point that um, I've installed too, just to clean it out. Uh, this line here goes to the basin, and we've put a, a waterless trap on there that means that the smell from the tank once it you know gets some um, solids and stuff in there the smell can't come up out the basin okay and then we've got a, just a bung hole down here and then right down the bottom that's the uh, dump valve so that just gets pulled out and then you've got these hoses here that you, you lock onto it pull the dump valve and then just you know dump it into the into the sewer now obviously you're gonna get stuff on your hands so you should wear gloves when you're emptying this thing and that's why we store a little tap here that you can wash your hands and stuff once you're finished, you know, with a bit of soap, which is great. And then the water, we, we, we wanted to get the other tank in here, but there just wasn't wasn't enough room in the end. So we managed to put the other tank here. It's a, I don't know, a fair, fair bit of water that we uh, put away there. Um, and so this is just the hose to to fill it up. So you can fill it up from there and also you can dump, dump the water in the tank or wash your hands again. So that's another thing that they can, they can do there. And we've got the Yorker pump there, little pre-line line filter, and this is the breather, the breather hose when it um, as you're filling it up. So still stacks of room under there. All works great. So if you've got a bus that you want a toilet put in, <laughs> give us a call. Uh, really good project, and uh, enjoyed uh, working with Damien, the owner of it. And so wish him all the best. So he's got plenty of water there. He could probably drive across the Nullarbor with uh, that much water. And having a toilet so anyway thanks for watching party on the boulevard we're riding through the dark night night with half a tank and empty heart pretending we're in love but it's never enough